Hey, it's Lost Earl here. Today we're in Staten Island, New York. We're with Hobie Cat. Hey, guys. And we're at Willowbrook. And uh, we're going to check this place out. There's a lot of buildings here, so this is probably part one. So let's go check this out. I'll tell you a little bit about it while we're inside. See you in a few. Here we go. Tile work. Here you can see the arch stone. This place is hit up with graffiti, man. Holes in the wall. This place closed in like 75. Raldo Rivera did a documentary here. Showed the horrible conditions of the place with children naked, covered in their own feces. We're coming in. Okay, look at this. Here, you know, stuff that here's the showers. What is actually closing there? Look at that. Get under this pipe. Found showers. Found showers? Yeah. This place is very decrepit. With the arch stone windows that they bricked in. Look at all them chairs. Whew. Oh, there was a fire here. Light switches. And so, and also, you may have heard of the Cropsy. Seven kids disappeared here in the seventies and eighties. And uh, Andre Rand was accused of abducting him. He was actually tried and sentenced for the kidnapping and murder of two of them. But there's still five that have never been found. Look at that old fire alarm. Rusted out. Baby powder. <laughs> It's an old fire alarm. Here we got a old lamp fixture for hanging from the ceiling. We got I don't know these heating units. Unbelievable, man. So, then there's all kinds of stories that go along with uh, Andre Rand. He, um, some say that, you know, there was a group of them, more than just him. Some of his buddies were involved, too, and they were kidnapping these kids and, like, pimping them out until they were like useless to them and killed them or there was rumors that they were 
kidnapping them for uh, sa sacrifices and they didn't want so you know there's rumors that there's hundreds of children's bodies buried out here yep, here's a toilet It's crazy. There's also rumors that, uh, you know, there's also some people who believe that Andre Rand was a patsy. Yeah, he didn't kill him in, he didn't kill him at all. That, uh, he was just set up because they needed someone to blame and real quick. But I find it odd that, you know, when, after he got arrested, the disappearances, the abduction stopped. So, you'd have to say that I would have to believe that it was him. Here's a stairwell. Alright, so that's cool. We'll go up the stairs and a few. Oh, here's lockers. More bathrooms, showers. piece the window that was originally there that's pretty cool look at that that's weird whoa it was weird that all that dust kicked up right when I pointed the camera at it I'm gonna head down this way real quick what is that like kind of a cabinet. Okay. Oh. There you go. Yeah, there's spiders up there. No thanks. Oh, it's like you can't even see the room numbers. That's yep. definitely a bathroom. I think this is where people slept, man. Cushions. They didn't even get private um, rooms. Yeah, well, imagine 1975 till now, dude. That's way over what, 30 years? Huh. Like just sitting here? They didn't even get private rooms. They got cubicles. The mattress. On top of the heaters. That must have been here forever. All right. We're going to go upstairs, I believe. These are the stairs. They're covered in dirt. 
How did it get that there? There's still more floors above us. So we'll go check them out too. Oh, a bathtub. It's broken. It's one of the ones with the claw foot feet. Old school. There's an old air conditioner on it, I believe. Bath, huh? Oh wow! Look at this. Like a porch. Pretty cool. Maybe this was a smoking area. You see a park? It's not a park. It's like a porch. Like right there. <laughs> We're on the second floor. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Where's it lead to? It's just outside. It's a little squared in area. All right, you want to split up and. I go this way, you go that way? Sure, but this is short. All right. All right. So we go in here. Kobe's going the other way. There's the uh, circuit breakers. Look at that window. Going into graffiti land. This place had all kinds of horrors. Apparently the first person abducted, it was a child, a seven-year-old, I guess. Seven-year-old boy was abducted and went disappeared. The last day I seen him walking with an elderly man. And that was in the 1920s. That's where, the, you know, the Cropsy. If you ever, you know, he could, See the documentary Cropsy, and you will get a good understanding of this place. Well, let's go down this way now. This whole shoe. desk I'll rust it out okay there's one of them doors they go wooden hospital doors so yeah this place was for uh the mentally disabled, horrible things, abuse, you know, they say on both ends, you know, patients being abused, staff being abused, America's last disgrace, that was Geraldo Rivera special on this place. If you want to learn more about uh, Andre Rand, you can watch Cropsy. Whoa. There's a shirt. Came all the way through. Yeah. What is behind this is wall? I've seen a couple of these already, these little doorways. Let's take a look at nothing. Oh, man. Light bulb's still there. Whew. Look, here's another one. And this was bricked off, but people undid it. Another one of these little balcony things. 
which is crazy because there are trees growing here. We're on the second floor. Well, let's go back inside. Might be one more floor up. We'll check that out after we go down this hall. Seven abandoned buildings in 1975. Oh, here are all the urinals. Here are all the stalls. No, no toilet paper here. Well, this is like living quarters, man. It's unbelievable. You know, no privacy. Well, let's go see what's upstairs. Third floor now. The window's pretty neat. Um, iron, handrails. Right. Oh, potato chips. Ain't much to this. A couple of little rooms up here. Look where squatters were. There's one of them emergency blankets. Oh! That wall. There we go, there's something. Looks like a heating unit, maybe. W4270. Yeah, I always say it has to do with heating. This here right here. Multi vein fan. Thermal event. Third event. Company, Boston, USA. Too bad there's no date, huh? Yeah, read this stuff. There you go, General Electric. Let's see. Uh, that's outside. Come over here. We're up on the roof of where we were before. There's trees growing up out here too. Pretty incredible. Let's take a walk over here. Walking on the roof. This is pretty crazy. We're gonna end up over in the same kind of poof building on the opposite side. That means people came out here. That had to be pretty dangerous.
All the way in. I think this is just going to be like a reverse of what we just came out of. Look at that. Oh, lamp. Yeah, I would have to say so. The door left on this one, A5. And there's the right on the opposite side of the other fan. Whew. There's a mattress. Again, another walkway to the roof above the dorms. And the stairway. Oh, hey, look, this door is still here. But all the, the middle part is gone. And the sergeant lock. An empty room. Alrighty. So we'll go back this way and find Hobie. Down to the basement. See that little cubicle? Probably had a fire extinguisher in there. Maybe a telephone. Oh, yeah. Down we go. <laughs> Fuse box. More rooms down here. Hey, look, a wheelchair. Oh, it's a short door. Get a whole light. There's Hobie's creepy chair. Whoa! Another room over here. Look at that. A little storage area. There's another creepy chair in there. Yeah, looks like they have more over here too. Hey, Christmas decorations. I think that's just access for plumbing. Unit box relay. Look at that. How bright the writing is still. 1972. Well, the rumors are tunnels. You know, and that's where uh, Andre Rand would bring the kids. Those are lamps. Well, you know, ceiling lamps. Wow. 
lot of debris in this place. What? No. Uh, I just heard you yell my name once. So. Oh, thank God you're okay, man. I'm gonna do it right now. I'm trying to go. Okay. I found the guy. He's still alive. He's still well. Woo! <laughs> oh my God. This is what happens when you come to Night Adventures, man. Uh, no, it was just a basement. Um, there's Hobie right there. Oh, God, guys. And uh, that was the first building. <laughs> Still down in the basement. So uh, there's probably more to come. So stick around. And uh, you know the routine. There's all kinds of creepy, abandoned schools out there. So uh, get out there and explore everything. See you next time. Hope you enjoyed.